Okay, hello, CB3. Um, um, hey, classmates, uh, teacher, Johanna Yestas, and everybody. Um, now, um, I'm gonna talk about how to prepare myself to succeed in personal and professional life. Um, we are always looking for the way to succeed. But how are we supposed to do it if we are um, always afraid? We are always afraid of falling. We invent any excuse um, or find any obstacle for us not to take care of our first step. Uh, there is a great lack of motivation on us to do uh, what we really want. Okay, in this um, TED talk by uh, Kerry Green, it uh, was about uh, programming uh, your mind for success. There's a quote that she said, uh, your destiny is determined by the choices you make. Choose now, choose well. No one is successful by luck. We must ask ourselves, where do we want to be in two, three, uh, ten? and 20 years uh, why do we why do we want to be there and uh, how are we going to do it so how are we gonna do it to be there uh, if you're not uh, giving all of you then you're not receiving anything you can do the, uh, you need to do the best you, you can to receive uh, what you really want. Um, another important thing that I saw there was about Cynthia McKay. She says that attempts uh, at self-employment usually fail for any of three reasons. The first one is procrastination. Uh, I didn't realize my own business will be this hard to set up. I don't have the time and stuff like that. The second one is uh, overwhelming goals. I looked at this option and there's just too much to do to make it work or um, what do you mean I have to have a business plan? Uh, I don't have an MBA. And the third one, and the last one, is um, under underfunding. Um, I have a few dollars and I'm going to see how far I can go. Uh, I'm going to do only what I have to do to get this thing going, uh, it can't be that expensive. So if we're not completely uh, decided or sure about ourselves, we simply can uh, begin. Other ways to, uh, uh, other w w ways you are going to fail. But always remember that if you fail, you will always have a second, a third, and a fourth chance to start it again. So uh, you need to stop limiting your mind. About those questions that you that we're gonna 
uh, ask you uh, the first question is how do you see yourself in the future as a as a successful person yes I see myself in the future as a successful a successful person because I'm studying a uh, hard now I um, I know what I want to do I know my goals and yeah I'm preparing to get there uh, another question is uh, what are you doing right now to successful in the future I'm I think the uh, the best thing that I'm doing now is just starting here in San Marano because when I was in Ecuador and I was studying there in, a, in another university I just uh, wasted my time there and I didn't yeah I just party every day and I didn't um, I didn't ¿Cómo se dice manejar bien el tiempo? Ok, uh, another thing is How do you plan to overcome those obstacles? Uh, I think the life is an obstacle So we need to prepare and um, keep it moving forward and doing the best you can to um, to pass that obstacles because if you if you if you uh, are still there you will never success another thing is do you think Samarano prepares you to be successful yes I think uh, Samarano is one of the best universities to to prepare to your life course you know here you have a lot of rules and uh, and the study is really hard here uh, I studied before in like two or three other university uh, universities and here in Samorano I think it's the hardest uh, study that I have never seen before so yeah i think this university is really good to focus on your goals and um and really helps you to uh, to be a better person better man better worker because here you study and you work and at the same time and other in, I, I, I don't know another university that can do that. Thank you.